got some demos. Here to see what shit I got myself into. Okay, it was some other people's shot. Let's see. The biggest problem now is um, this. Minus 12 fucking public order. Fuck you, game. Plus minus uh, 20 morale. What could possibly go wrong with that? Thankfully, all of our troops have a shitload of morale, right? the fuck there. Hmm. So does it actually count in the, the debuff we got already? Can't really tell. My skills are yours. You'll have an issue where I don't know where, which way I'm gonna expand here. I can't keep... Uh, they're all over the place. And I can't leave this open. Hmm. Right, uh, first things first. We got issues down here. Still. We hunger for battle. Laying siege to the settlement! Let's do the battle, why not? Like they sallied out. Oh, that's gonna go well for them. We're gonna have three catapults. We await your command, General. Equites ready, ready. Evocati, Romans ready for Evocati. How the fuck did these end up there? Actually know how long this uh, debuff lasts on them. It'll be interesting to see. It'll be actually useful for once. Because um, melee attack, melee defense, and 
well, the, the decrease is firing, firing range. Causes fatigue as well. So good. I keep on get out of that now. Why do they always go for them? I mean, that's so fucking useful. Just keep those in uh, attack instance too, that they all target them and just, you know. Basically, they don't have any. Have any. Uh, ranged enemy uh, troops. Because they all just abuse that. Stupid fucking AI. As per usual. about it for them. Now oh, let's check the morale now. Morale is still pretty fucking high, even though we have the debuff. Catch him. There we go. Easy peasy. Only 69 losses. Of course. What other number could it be? thing is I'm gonna take all of this and they're gonna I'm gonna have another rebellion or a civil war that's gonna be fun I need to move this guy so he doesn't lose troops okay that's all fine all right I do need to check the fleets all right we got the um, Pirates there, if I remember correctly. Mm. 
Now let's we'll see. It is an honor to serve Rome. Okay, we took one of their fleets out here. Right, the idea was to like uh, hop an army over. But I move them up here. Can you move here? I need to see what's here. Fuck all, apparently. Um. 80%. Yeah, I have to fight it. I don't want to lose that many troops. Especially since um, Arta might declare war on me, and they're right there. Oh, is this one again? Um, so last time I destroyed a bunch of uh, walls and I couldn't get some of their skirmisher off of them. Something like that happened. The merry freaking. How's this going? Oh, we have ballistas here. Um, let me change a few things. I gotta break down a wall there, that's for sure. Birkin? Alright, where am I blind? Give me a second. Birkin, yeah. Let's break down a wall there. Somewhere around here. And on the other side. This should be easy. They only they don't have that much in here. Ballista! Tribunus! Charged walls. Would be actually pretty nice if you can actually like just come up to them and place ladders like in a warhammer, but um maybe be too easy. Mars, eh? When this battle is done, the name of gonna break down the walls. We got no other choice. I mean, I would go burn down the gates, but it just takes a million years to do that. Not worth it. Not at all. Plus, using the siege equipment, you never know. You never know when it's gonna like uh, bug out. Why not? They only have the garrison force here. Nothing else. Don't have anything. That one's gonna be pretty easy. Because they, they don't have enough troops to cover all the fronts. Basically. Why don't you shoot them over there? The walls are breached! the ground and the circle them and then wipe them all out well i am gonna circle them uh, or you know sandwich them here just might take a bit more time and i do need to get to all of these here yeah, look at look at that they left this side wide open had a bit uh some difficult sieges in the last couple of uh swings Should get off now. Let's get on the walls here. 
slow this down too. Where the hell are you going? I'm, uh, Total War Empire? I don't really play that again. I never liked the Empire or Napoleon games. For some reason. It's not my cup of tea. There is a mod uh, for Medieval 2, I think, which... Uh, I can't remember uh, what it's called, but... Uh, you can play as, as some colonial factions in... Uh, in South America. And you can play as a uh, Europe, but like at the end of Pike and Shot, line infantry era. So that could be the same thing, just a mod. Easter, uh, Easterlings? Uh, which, which game though? Shogun 2? Because all of the, I think all of the Total Wars have a uh, Lord of the Rings mod, basically at this point. I was thinking of playing the Shogun one. I'm not sure if the Easterlings are in that one though. Yet. Yeah, Attila has a Lord of the Rings mod. There's so many Lord of the Rings mods, I just don't know which one you mean. Then. has used all its ammunition. Proud Romans all. Proud Romans all. Yes. Indeed. It's gonna take forever to get the cable around. Is that for Total War? Which one is it? Shogun Two. Yeah, yeah. I, I was. Uh, I was gonna play this one. I might do the Easterlings. I just need to play it a little bit more because uh, you know it, it plays. It's Shogun, but it doesn't play like Shogun. <laughs> Orders. Really? I like the, uh, the troops are a bit different. Sons of Mars. Double time. So th this one, The Last Alliance, is for Shogun 2. I have that on one already downloaded, I think. There's also a... Uh, Lord of the Rings mod for Medieval 2, if I remember correctly. Or even uh, Rome 1, actually. I'd be surprised. We have captured a tower. Just charge him in the back. Mod for Android? All right, Rome 1 is an android, and Medieval 2, right? Come here. It would be pretty cool if they had mods for the android versions of the game, but uh, I mean, even having Total War on Android is pretty cool at, on it, in it of itself. Just charge him in the back. And come here. Just go up over there. Phalanx. So much for their phalanx. I need to relieve that group over there. 
ça marre. This way, actually, one of them go around. Can we move these around here? I hope so. Uh, I don't think that mod is out yet for the public. I think it's only for the well, bigger YouTubers. I will play the evil faction, that's for sure. Like, because, like, playing with elves, dwarves, Gondo, come on, or hear him. That's been done to death already. Easterlings and, uh, what? Rohirrim, yes. No, not Rohirrim. Wait, there's the Easterlings and what the, uh, What are the Hadrat, right? Something like that. i play as them, definitely. Yeah, see ya, Mary. No problem. We'll do the Lord of the Rings mod, definitely. On the list. This is just taking a little while to finish. My luck, he's gonna get killed there. <laughs> Let's not uh, risk it. Would you stop running away? One of our units has used all its ammunition. Okay, I think he's speeding us up. General. What the hell are these guys still alive? Very light missile infantry, come on. that. Yeah, fighting Phalanx and then lost one guy so far. There we go. Check when was the last update for the Lord of the Rings mod. 21st of May. Interesting. Ooh. Yeah, the one I got was Durings Folk. Durings Folk. No, never mind. No way. I think that was a long time ago, actually. Oh, that's March, right? Yeah. Makes sense. Yeah. Occupy this. Yeah, this this is what I meant. Fighting these in the city walls is gonna be pain in the ass, to say the least. I serve only Rome. But uh, let me check if they messed up the buildings here. They did not actually. Interesting.
Ready for orders. I always make the same mistake with when fighting these. You don't want to let them like he be in the streets. You need to fight them in the open. So if they attack, it might be actually a better idea to fight him on the in outside the settlement, not inside the settlement. We hunger for battle. So we're gonna place these here. March. Look to the defenses. Towards fire. I'm so surprised I didn't lose any troops Ready in this army. That battle here was was something else. Right, let me check. Yeah, the, I have these guys. The funny thing, they can just walk through and then I would declare war on me. Very heavy melee infantry. 19 melee at them. Ready for battle. Yeah, they're a bit better than my guys, that's for sure. Where's my other army? Right, I have it here to attack that if they declare war. Do I remember this? Glass smelter. Problems here. It's gonna take forever to get that up. Hmm. Some reason I thought this gave public order. For some reason. <laughs> Look at that. 16 day, uh, turns and days. It's gonna take for fucking ever. Right, I do still need to try to get these up there somewhere. Promote them and whatnot. Salt myself, that's nice. Serves me right for just using my guys, the generals. Funny if you see you see one of them like assassinated in the next turn or something. <laughs> okay, seek spouse. That like helped didn't help at all. It's even worse. Where air? 
educate, adopt, divorce, do a favor. God damn. Never liked the political system in these games. To be completely honest. Like, uh, uh, wait. Yeah, I can insult my home party, uh, political party members or my family members. That's fucking funny. Uh, let's see. Right, there's one guy that's not married here. Where is he? And he cannot seek a spouse yet. How much money we got? 6k. Let's send some of these out. Egypt, definitely. My skills are yours. You stay there. What do you wish of me? Move a little bit here. A shadow among shadows. What's up, Rebar? How's it going? Seeking the enemy. I'm fine. Procrastinating on some uh, college I stuff, as per usual. Having political problems here. Something tells me I'm a dictator. <laughs> we decreased our control by 1%. Jesus fucking Christ. I kind of want to switch out the generals in my parties. For like battle. them, but all the buffs you get from them are too too good to give up at the moment. Bit unfortunate. What? It is an honor to serve Rome. It is an honor to serve okay, Rome. Stay there. Right, I need to dock you as well. Ready? What do you wish of me? Yes. It is an honor. Your orders, Commander. Ah! We hunger for battle. I guess I can switch this guy out. If you can, that is. I think I used up all the, the party members. Yeah, it, now it costs apparently 34,000 denarii or septums to hire someone. Which um, can't be done at the moment. Plus, look at the situation here. I got the Empress. I fucked up with them. I should have killed them at the beginning of the game. Got some of these guys still hanging on, but should be finished in a couple of turns. Got probably all the problems all over the place, though. Gods of the afterlife. Plus, eh, maybe I can, maybe I can lower that down by one. Plus six. All right. Let's switch this. Yeah, okay, just taking that. That's fine. I think Africa is the biggest problem here. Would have thought that the Carthaginians and their ghosts will cause problems.
Who would have thought? Could be a good idea to like just. Uh, problem is if I attack the British or the Bretons, I see. Me. I have to go up there. And I cannot peel off an army to go up there yet. front with the Empress and the Greeks is too large to cover with what I got there. What, I got three armies and I'm gonna peel off two from Africa and once I finish the separatists off. That should be enough. But then I'm just opening up more fronts. Which is uh, the issue here. Maybe I should have recruited more shit stacks. Then again, I don't think we have shit stacks at this point. Everything costs a lot. Everything costs a shitload. even worse the Illyrians stealing everything six percent six percent of risk of war and we're still at the civil war <laughs> Oh, that's bad. Got no cash, man. You see something? You want peace, motherfucker? Yes, they do. Well, do You're gonna pay for it. Mute as though with the you don't have... Let me fix up everything else first. Keep them there to replenish a bit more. They want the trade agreement, finally. I give you greeting and my Nope. I am sure you have many pleasantries for me, but please don't bother. Talk of meat, not Guards above. Witness that my yeah, they don't want anything. Hmm. Now it might be time to like... Now let's take out the secessionists first, fuck everything else. any of these actually do anything to help us out here. Come on. What's a bold hussar? Hussar? How's it going? 
Okay, we can do a favor with her. Problem is now all these generals we do have are so like level up. Now I need to increase the public uh, the tax again. We just need a tiny bit more. Then we can uh, get this a little bit better. Okay, now let's see here. Inch through the desert. At your command. Ready for further orders. At your command. Advance. We hunger for battle. March. On the move. Yeah, I think the fleets are in the place that they should be in, right? More or less. At your command. You have further orders? Any man who drops out is left behind. You can maybe not set them to patrol, actually. Just lurk. It's gonna be a while till we get through the desert here and attack these. Let's see what their forces are. Mercenary hoplites. How can I be of assistance? Swift and silent as a shepherd. My skills are yours. Oh, they got some Praetorian. Ooh, ooh. Look at that. I still have Prink Pays early and a bunch of trash, but still. They're gonna be a bit difficult to get rid of. We hunger for battle. I do wish uh, the Egyptians actually declared war on them here. Let's see, can we? Can we persuade them? I would sooner place my own entrails in canopic jars than listen, but speak your words anyway. I don't think they will. No, they will not. I mean, at this point, yeah, I'm gonna have to get rid of this shit. seen it before they backstab me at the critical point somewhere down the line and I could probably have like two armies up here and just beat them back and then just keep get getting money from them when I piece them out Actually, I think the Spartans are going to declare war on me before the rest of them all.
Hmm. But this sure looks damn well with the taxes. Gonna fail miserably. Okay. Let's get the supply pit here, actually. Or, maybe a better idea to get the field of Mars. Because we do need a staging ground in the Balkans. Can you take that now? Okay, this guy should be able to make it there next turn. And he went off course. Of course. Right. Oh, right, right. That's why I didn't declare war on them. My time is better spent feasting. Our traders will look out. Do not attempt to sweeten truth with honey. I don't know why it doesn't tell me like how many turns I need to wait before it like you know I can declare war without any issues. Okay, we don't need a spy there anymore. Let's uh, bring her this way. Let's check out this area up here. Can we move down there? I don't think we can move. Yeah, let's keep. Let's get start switching over to the other one. It's gonna take a million years to get to. Never mind, we don't have the money. I forgot. Or no, since if I do bring that down, that's gonna be good. We're gonna have public problems in Rome. Public order problems in Rome. Now, if I get another city from sending diplomats all over the place, that's going to be fucking annoying, to say the least. Somewhere where I don't need it. It would be a bad idea to save off the money to recruit those either. Oh, there's another faction up here. Since when? Oh, wow, well, look at that. Right, they are at war with them. Okay, so the Britons are not going to be able to, like, uh... Oh, I got an idea. Come, come. Let we can possibly in. abuse this. I have no stomach for the meek or night. So let's do that next turn. I live to serve Rome. At your command. Can abuse that and just jump them immediately. In service to Rome. Ready for orders. Okay, you're fine enough. Just get out. Steady as we go. We hunger for battle. You know, those Spartans are going to be a problem. Thank you. 
I think that was a problem. I shouldn't have switched to the horses. We don't actually need better horses all that much. Or better cav. Because the only time I lose them is when I fuck up royally. The Irish are gonna take out the Bretons. <laughs> oh God! They're already sending armies to look uh, look straight at mine. Oh fuck! God damn it, game. I'll try to win this so I don't have to go back. bit difficult, but they only have five units and whatever the fucking uh, fire ship has. 60, 80. See me fail, probably, against these. Left the city undefended. The bad guy. True that. Wait a minute. Oh, they're showing up here, right. After the crashing time? <laughs> um, well, I don't actually get that many crashes, even with the mod here. So that's good, I guess. Only way I'm going to win this battle is if I outflank them, I guess. Let's just see where they're going to show up into. It depends on how many mods you get in there. You can become a bit uh, finicky later on if you got like three or four or more in them. Like for some reason, the ancient empires one for uh, Attila just keeps crashing on me. I can't get it to or bugging out. Troops like just don't want to move. They're like stuck on a wall or something, but they're on the ground. So that's fun. Come on. If I have to wait here for these 60 minutes to go up, of them just bobbing around in the water, that's gonna be fucking nice. Okay, there we go. Get the spearman in front. Been good if their commander actually dropped in first. Our general is under attack. Or he is. General. Oh shit! Right, this guy. This these have a ballista or Scorpio on them, or not? 
Oh, the, right, they're in the little towers where a man can't fit in. They have dwarves, apparently. Okay, how about you get out of there? Blank everything, if possible. Thing at the bottom of the screen, if uh, you can really figure out at the moment what you mean. If it's something on Twitch, I don't really focus that much on Twitch, I focus more on YouTube. Our men flee the field, Our men flee the field of battle. Of course they, of course they do. Cavalry. Yeah, they're getting off. That's not good. They're not gonna break, are they? I don't think they will. Maybe. I should be able to move up with a fleet here to kill them off. Bottom of the screen. Alright, hosting you. On the dashboard. Flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Sons of Mars. Come on. Jupiter gives us strength. There's one's breaking. Getting uh, their commander might be a bigger issue here. He's gonna have a shitload of morale. It seems a bit this, these guys are a bit uh, stuck, and I do I do have a yeah I do need to send you this link. This this was so much bullshit. Give me a second. Clips on YouTube though. Like at a certain party. At, oh, Andrew here with the raid as well. Thank you guys. Like I was fighting a siege battle on a city and I had a whole fleet of marines come in, bug out on the disembark, and then go off the map and die because they were stuck on the ship. Or well, the ships went off the map at least. Yeah, that one. Pissed me off to no end. One of our units Did you win, Andrew? Swords, we obey. This is gonna be painful. Italian swordsmen, spears. One of our units has used all its ammunition. You lost. Let's see you fucked up with heavy MGs in Company of Heroes. I don't want to get more than one, I'd say. Really have to get lucky to... Come on, move. You really have to get lucky for the MG spam sp to work, to be honest. I'm still gonna suck if these just bug out there. Okay, they are done. Run this way fast. Our men flee the field of battle. 
This is a shameful display. Oh yeah, the Company of Heroes is really bad. I feel like there's like no in the middle players. They're all just super good or super bad. Or they just like they lose one unit, they're like beginning strategy doesn't work and they just rage quit. That's even worse. I did play some Company of Heroes. Although I do lose often. Especially once uh, if you play as the Germans and the British uh, get the encampments and everything is set up. But I mean the... Uh, actually, you don't charge. If the mortar pits down, uh, then you're fucked. Come on, it's only one unit. Surrounded. One of our units has used all its ammunition. <laughs> Company of Heroes still players. Come on, why is Swift is uh, Skippy streaming? He's pretty good. Surely we can beat one commander unit. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Go on. Men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Doesn't seem like it. Doesn't look like it. No, no, no. God fucking damn it. Display. And I knew I had to do something with the fleet. I just couldn't remember what. Our men flee the field of battle. This yeah, apparently they're losing now. That's a good sign. Never mind. Men flee the field of battle. This is a sh one of our units has used all its ammunition. <laughs> our men flee the field of battle. This is a shame. Oh, these guys just chilling here. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Look at that. So fucking close. Oh. This is a shame. Come on. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Oh my god, we fucking won. Well. We need to wait for this guy. To be done. Now if they did drop off, we would lose definitely. Look at that. He's supposed to be whales. Yep. Oh. Uh, I don't know which total war, but in one of them you could have like just cause you know quit the battle and it, you wouldn't lose because you know. Look at that. Let's get them over here, just in case. Now we just need to wait. <laughs> what a hard fought battle. And after, when did the Total War uh, Realm 2 release? Two thousand and thirteen. So almost ten years ago, and this is still a thing. No 
channel gives me time to see if Skippy is streaming. I do like his videos because he, he does just uh, fuck around a lot in Company of Heroes. He does some stupid shit. And it actually works from time to time, which is even funnier. Helping Hans is streaming though. 2v2s. Thanks, Matthijs. I'm glad you enjoy. I think I'm gonna. Uh, I think when I finish upload, uh, upload it, or finish this and upload it, and uh, I think the Tessogen mod, the Tessogen uh, playthrough for Ben Lord, I finished uploading. So those two are gonna be uploaded to YouTube. Everything else is just gonna be a wad from the stream. From then on, I might make a uh, like a couple of videos with the highlights and whatnot for the, for the games though after that see you, Andrew this this might take a while we're only there's only 31 minutes left Like I said, when we do, when I do, when I could show you all the fancy stuff this mod, this mod has, in compared to like the vanilla to the wall. Well, I mean, I guess I could show you now. No, 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 that timer's not gonna be going. Open up Steam, though. Okay, so the, the battles are overhauled, so they do take longer. There's over 2,000 new units. Uh, I don't think it's that high, to be honest. The population system and the supply system are the ones, the things you need to like look out for. That's that's what really changes the game. The reforms work like in Realm One, I'd say more or less. I think it's a uh, based on your technology plus what date it is, or what year it is in-game. It's a mix of that. Culture works the same. Basically. The economy... You either, you either make a shitload of money... Thanks for the follow, the dude. Dodd. You either make a shitload of money or, making, or you make none. Which is... A bit funny. But, uh, but what can you do? Actually, if you do need money, just send out diplomats. Most of them, they, most of them come back with tribute, if the factions don't hate you. Which uh, late game is, uh, well, all of them hate you. Late game. And the, uh, and the generals have a lot more traits to to choose, and you do want to uh, let uh, get your generals to higher levels. You know, not just rush them in into a battle. They die. How to survive early game. This guy can survive his room. It's pretty fucking easy at the beginning. Uh, well. I guess it depends on RNG if it's easy or not. 20 minutes. God damn. No, but if I didn't move my troops over there, I think one of them would break. So, I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna risk it. Now we do we 
wish the marines actually looked a bit more different than the regular troops. All the ones you can recruit do actually, they're blue, like in blue uniforms instead of the red ones. Come on. I guess this is a good showcase, right? Even though these are, I think, curly. Yeah, they got the... Pila and spears instead of the melee or swords as their primary. And plus another thing is you don't want to keep your armies inside settlements at all. Because they decrease the public order or fleets either. But you do want to get generals who are specifically specifically going to be governors. And there are traits for that as well. But you're going to run into a problem which I have now, which uh, I control the Senate and everything, so I'm a tyrant. tyrant. So I get the minus 12 public order debuff, plus a minus 20 morale debuff. Which kind of hurts. Just a wee bit. Only 10 more minutes in game of us. What else is there? this mod show you right there's a different uh, recruit system so you can't actually recruit units from a place that doesn't have the population for it like at the beginning the triarii are patricians so you can't recruit them if you don't have the patricians in there, in the settlement. You do need to be careful with that, because if you, you can't replenish them unless the place you're at actually has them. A population of them, or plebs, or... Uh, what were the other one? One of the ones are called, called proletari. Workers. So it's a lot slower than regular Rome, I guess. It would be interesting to play some of the factions, though. Not the, like, skirmisher-based ones, definitely not. I hate skirmishers, but, like, um... I guess the Bretons would be a challenge. Because the Gauls do start off strong. Can't really... And anywhere else. Plus, there's a lot of videos on YouTube you will want to watch the overviews of them. Okay, one minute. Or was it two? Well, it doesn't matter. It's gonna be over soon. Look at that. A flag of Poland. <laughs> Finally. We, we even had more troops. That makes a difference. The corpse of an enemy always smells sweet.
Yeah, run. Run the fuck away, pieces of shit. Sneaky bastards. Which reminds me, I do need to bring a fleet over there. Just in case they try something like that again. Now the game sometimes look like looks like it's crashed, but um, there's just too too much stuff to load in. Okay, there we go. Name's color. Okay, that's normal, normal. No, oh, that's bad. Okay. So the the population system, you can look at look at that up here. We have the stats for Rome itself here. If you click here, it's gonna show us the the stats for that city. So see here Patricians, Plebeians, Proletarian, I think slaves is the last one. Or no 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 no, like uh, Immigrants, I think is the last one, I guess. You cannot recruit them if you don't have them here. See, each one has a the one that it requires down here. Plus, I can't remember where I have the mercenary tent. I guess I could show it here. Yeah, these are like um, client state troops or auxiliaries. And they do cost a lot less. Ready for battle. Well, that's not convenient. Yeah. Good thing the revolts happen like that close to. You move down there. Ready for orders. And these guys don't have enough supply here. They're forging for food. We need to finish up this battle as soon as possible. Okay, I'm not gonna auto resolve this. I'm gonna fight it then. Because you didn't want. 84% losses, eh, that's, or remaining force, that's acceptable, I'd say. Any more losses than then, and you when I always fight the battles. How the hell do reinforcements come this way? I don't know. I think I want to bring one catapult this way, though. On the go! And the tortoise is gonna plug out, so let's leave that somewhere else. Actually, let's leave everything here. You come this way. Proud Romans all. Many troops awaiting order. And now let's see. Bring down the walls there. Would be good if I can knock out the gate as well. As for the horses, you come this way. Regionalize. Ready. Have 
Your orders. Okay, two there, two inside, the one through the gate. Keep these here. Missile infantry for command. Legionaries. Legionaries. Just the firing. I'm sure this would be a smarter idea, right? Our reinforcements have arrived. Okay, they're running away. That's good. as well. The battle is turning in our favor. Sure, they have a shot on that. They do apparently. Eighty percent. Now this area. What? No, no, no. If I destroy that, I can't get up there. I don't think. I don't think. You're fucked. <laughs> Definitely. Brave Romans to a man. Do they not have the range here? Understood. They do not, apparently. The walls are breached. Okay. Oh, nice. Look at that. Here. Actually, we just start firing here. There's no enemies on this side. map. No need them yet anymore.
Why are they even hitting the wall? Okay, they are. Just uh, knocking out. I think after this one, the, the secessionists only have two settlements. After this one. So we should be done with them in a bit. And then I beast out Epirus for now. Oh, yeah, for some reason your troops can't pass there. That's nice. Also broken. Just get through. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Romans ready for duty. Happy to Would have been good if these guys actually had a shot on them. The walls are breached. Yeah, that's enough. How's this? Come on. The walls are breached. There you go. Should I just should uh Get them with the cab. Those are sk skirmishers. Look at that. I'm not gonna even get to use these, to be honest. I'm not gonna make it there in time. Okay, cabs in there. Don't chase him, what the fuck? You just hold that. Of course, these guys got stuck on the two guys over there. Let's get in here, come on. This is broken. Come on, chase him down. Stuck on swordsman. Oh well. Maybe 
Maybe melee. How about not? What the f What the hell is this Congo line? One of our units has used all its ammunition. And this guy doesn't want to stop and fight. Neither did these, apparently. Those are broken. One of our units has used all its ammunition. I could die them tie them down with the cow, but um I don't wanna lose these units for no reason. To be honest. That's it. Yup. Easy peasy. Only 86 losses. That's far better than 80. What was it? 84% troops left. Dodge gob. Dodge gob. Yeah. Didn't read that before. A bit blind. Fish amphitheater, okay, everything's fine here. Make it library. We hunger for battle. Ready for battle. On the move. I just need to get through here. Kill them off. Come on. This guy move. Yes, he can. Nice. Experience, session losses. Let them power before Rome. Oh, for fuck's sake, game. Let's get us some trash. Should name this one uh whatever the word for separatists crashes. Separatist the land asked. Sons of Mars! Melee in 
infantry ready. Take that man's name. His armor is a disgrace. You! What's your bloody name and number? Evocati! I love the banter between the troops. It doesn't seem like the debuffs last that long, to be honest. shooting the Ongers? How the fuck? Come on. That's a nice sandwich. 60% loss, 40% loss. Fuck you, game. Now, actually, that last battle is going to be a bit difficult because the like, the early Triarii are pretty good phalanxes, to be honest. Phalanx units. There might be a bit of trouble to get rid of them. Cohort unit gets a um, legionary gets stabbed by a what is it? Town watch, town guard. Oh god. Well, granted, those are uh, retired legionaries, right? Makes a bit of sense. Just in one turn. No, they cannot. Good. Hunger for battle. Destination reached. Okay, those are correct. Oh, this is what we need. Oh, thank God. More public order.
swift and silent. A shadow of shadows. Let's say I was gonna attack this. Just need to ask these guys for permission. Are you brave or foolish or just mad? Well speak. The gods. Uh, that did lower our reliability rating, but um, I mean, at this point, not like it matters. Ooh. Now I see why they say their garrisons are pretty good. These these guys are gonna be a bit tougher to beat. And the idea is to block these here and piece the British shout, maybe. Yeah, that guy alone can't do shit. Tiny bit more. When you get to that point where you need to salt your own family. about it I think the corruption is the thing that's screwing me here definitely Right, I didn't check what I was researching, but I think we're more or less done with research. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. Much preferable than fighting them in the city, that's for sure. The only problem here is I think they have yeah they have more infantry than I do. Evercati, melee troops, Romans ready for duty. Melee infantry at your command. Romans ready for duty. Melee infantry ready. Not much of a cheer. Proud Romans all. Eagle cohort. Avocati. Brave Romans to a man. Legionary cavalry. Brave Romans to a man. Legionaries. the hell are their champions warriors but oh, they're only medium 
I could have swore they're fucking uh, heavy. If they want to sit there and skirmish with my ballistas right there, then fine with me, to be honest. It looks like they figured out that was a bad idea. ammunition. ammunition. Well, I mean, if they're just gonna stand there. has used all its ammunition. Proud Romans, equities! Oh. Ballista! One of our units has used all its ammunition. Legionary cohorts! Legionary cavalry! Ready and waiting! Ready! Commander! Your orders! Eagle cohorts! Your orders! Missile infantry ready! of Mars! At speed! Ready! As quick Mars! Ready! Extemplo! Ready! Legacy! One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, just shoot at them. Come on. Yeah, the champions are holding on a little bit. Now, 
can't remember if you need to kill them all here. I don't think you do, actually. I think you don't need to kill all of them to get into the settlement. Without a fight, that is. Not completely sure, though. Am I still re remaining in the settlement because I didn't kill enough of them? I guess we'll find out. Let's find out. 57 losses. There are 3,000. Yeah, sh should have fought that. Should have wiped them all out. Oh god, that that one guy is raiding over there. That's gonna fuck up my public order. F Ooh. The I see he might be wiped out next turn. Seems like it at least. That's not good. I don't want them moving around. I want them to stay there. I don't need to chase them down afterwards. from the food. Ugh. A lot of children were born. Belly name in it. Oh, that's fucking perfect. Rebels in Italia. Hmm. I don't know, like. I wish there was like a big, bigger difference from these. I mean, there is a difference. These are recruited from plebs, or these are patricians. Oh, right, we can recruit one of them. Yeah, that should be enough for anything that comes my way there. there. Let's see here. Right, right, right. Let's get rid of this first. At 
Now we should be fine without going after that guy. Unless they have an army hiding somewhere as well. Yeah, the so these are important a lot in this. You do want to get generals who are just going to be capable bureaucrats and uh, rightful sovereigns. And that's going to help you the most. Okay, get that. Commander of men. My skill. You stay there. Forty-four percent chance. I'll take it. And we were rewarded. You stay there for now. You as well. I want to move this army to take Memphis down here, but um, and let this left leave that undefended for now. Well, let's bring you to Cyrene. Yes, let's move these up on the border. Ready for orders. Our advance has been halted. How can I be of assistance? Swift. Let's actually scout out their territory. The Spartans here. Are, look at that. I'm probably not going to win if they all attack at once. It is an honor to serve Ready for battle. To be honest. Those cost 34,000 for some reason. Is. Right, right. Uh, Dalmatia. We're a Lyricum. That's building there. Good. None of that is going to fix up our public order. Actually, can anyone get the promotion? Yes, they can. Anyone else? Let's see, they sh I should have something that gives them a grab the Asper turn. I may have used all those up. Yeah, I should have been sending these over to the other factions. I got too many of their killed. Their family members killed. Okay, that should be enough. To get the Empire Maintenance now. Grab that as well. 
Let's see what the rebellion at Rome is gonna look like. I'm so surprised the Seleuc Seleucids are still alive at this point. And they got attacked by everyone, basically. Have an idea. Might need to blitz the Spartans. Like knock out their city so they starve to death. Otherwise it's gonna be an issue dealing with them. Especially I do need to fight them on the field, otherwise in the cities they're gonna kill me. Look at that, 43k, nice. No, that's bad. Now, can I get to that guy? These guys hate me. We now need to schmooze them a bit more. If you can, others. another civil war right now to be honest If I attack him with two armies, he's gonna run away, so let's attack him with one. I'm gonna go take a quick piss break while this crashes. <laughs> That's nice. I didn't quick save either. Oh, that's gonna suck. Well, not much. We didn't do that much. Out the date mods, ignore the warning. 
At least you get to watch something interesting. What's up, Sludge? Might actually be a better idea to just assassinate that other party, to be honest. Won't be ha a bad idea at all. No, no, wait. God damn it. Why didn't they make kids? <laughs> Yeah, sneaky. I can't really remember what happens if you kill off another party, do? Are only the two other ones left, or what happens? I think there always needs to be three other than yours, that is. Well, let me deal with this first so it doesn't crash again. No, this is the enter, never mind. They make a constitution. <laughs> there is a time when warriors must sheath the sword and talk. Okay, that's new. I mean, they're dead either way, so uh, might as well just get some money out of them. Shit. We can always do that on the start of the turn. <laughs> the two-party system is always better than the... What? Who heard that? Whoever heard of three parties doing anything good? Fuck that. You need the Republicans and the Democrats. What's the difference? Uh, uh. There is no difference. A slight difference in the shade of uh, corruption. No, they ran away this time. Well, that changes a few things. Two-party system is basically illusion. Well, isn't democracy an illusion of freedom as well? Because people like uh, forget a bit. Like, uh, wait, I'm going to put. I'll, uh, okay, now we don't have a imminent civil war. Like the last time. 
Like democracy is an illusion of uh, pe uh, pe yeah, pe uh, people are in power, people my ass. Because if you rem remember in Greece, the people who wanted to charge were the normal guys, the eugenicists, eugen, whatever the fuck the, the rich bastards with a lot of slaves were called. They were in charge. What the? Oh my god. Yeah, move move through the fucking north part of the province to attack them. That's what I wanted. Okay, that's finished. That's finished. Yeah, it's not a democracy. is not the rule of people or whatever how it, how it's called in English. But the uh, rule of the rule of the wealthy, basically, that's about it. The privileged. Let me just save again, just in case. Ready for orders. Ready for orders. Advance. Waiting for more orders. At your command. March. Halmir, swift and silent as a shadow. At your command. And I want to get this guy moving through here, but I think they can get there in one turn. Because, uh, you know, it's the AI. AI will always cheats. <laughs> Is that Spartacus? No, wait, they rebelled at Capua. Well, there is no Capio. Commander. Just uh, get this thing here sorted first. I guess let's get a. Uh... Give me a second. A stadium as well. And I do have an idea down here. Is there a good place to set up an ambush? Probably not. 18%. Well, I mean, I could just uh, do this. Maybe they're running. Maybe they're blind. Maybe. Okay, we do have a risk of civil war, but it just didn't tell me. Well, are still more cunning. I'm pretty sure my all of my generals have more than enough cunning for this. <laughs> Let me save this again, just in case. <laughs> Oops. Well, that wasn't me. It just gets replaced by another. Hmm. 
Okay, the other idea was a bit better, I think. Just uh, increase relations with him. Fuck him. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't you know that wasn't me. Come on. Empire dictated. <laughs> this is a republic, quote unquote. Maybe I should. Uh, would a good idea would be I don't know. Why did I even switch to the empire? All oh, right, more generals and more edicts. These other parties did better, though. But kind of. Which one's the improved relations? This one. Now I got to spend all my money on this shit. I wish we could make this family tree a smaller though. It's going through this. It's sufficient zeal. They just had to change the politics system and make it uh, annoying, to say the least. I just want to conquer the shit, not worry about politics, man. I mean, uh, in Attila, it's much better, I'd say. It's not as annoying as in here. Risk of civil war now, four percent. God damn it! Yeah, messing with the loyalty system here is a bit annoying. Look, like, look how many generals and wives and everything else do these guys have. And their influence is still shit compared to the other, other ones. Or to the one faction down here. And I just need a tiny little bit more so I can get the public order in order. They got an uh, army sitting right on my border. Why wouldn't they? Like everyone else. Right, I wanted to see how far Epirus has grab land.
Right, I forgot to pick up these with the Essini. Hmm, maybe I should have looked. Uh, I think uh, David the Emperor has a lot of some mods. Maybe there is a mod that uh, makes the politics a bit less annoying to deal with. Because the deal I was pretty simple. You don't want to get all the governors unless you expand a lot. You want to get all the governors in your fam family. Because they're going to gather the most influence. Yeah, and you can manage loyalty a lot easier. A criminal gang is running a rampart, bringing chaos to the streets of Rome. However, dealing with the problem is not as simple as it may first appear, as the gang is rumored to be under the protection of a patrician from a prominent gens. And thus, beyond the law, the plebs are in great distress and threaten secession. I didn't play Three Kingdoms, I kind of... Like the, I mean, I did look at it and everything, but... Um, how you recruit units and the generals and everything else just seems odd to me. I might play it again at some point. Plus, then again, I did, when I did look at it, it was like, you know, I mean, just released. Okay, this is what we need. We need to... Shit. We need to improve these guys. Grab the Aspartin, that's what we need. And now we need the Empire Maintenance. There we go. Okay, don't take that. Wait a minute. What's for turn for ruling political part? Okay, so don't take that, right? see this this may be a problem because it took everything for this uh, political reformer for everyone that may have screwed me yeah that yeah that well we can go without that I think now to be honest no need that much uh, research speed now Let's catch these real quick. I mean, we'll take a look at Three Kingdoms later on again. Ready for battle. This guy can't make it. There might be a better idea to get these to attack us. And me attacking them, to be honest. Because we do want them to get out of the city here. Hmm. Having some good luck with the spies, to be honest. Mm. 
Commander. Well, actually. Nah. What's the garrison here like? Almost full. Not sure if I can beat that, to be honest, though. With the garrison. So I'm gonna risk it to move these to the other settlement that is Memphis. See, all the other parties are pretty much, you know, good with me. I just need this one party to stop bitching. Let's see if there's anything for uh, Gravitas. Not really. Any promotions we can get? Yes, we can. Actual promoting her as well should be good. It's gonna give us uh, more uh, loyalty with him. Oh well, we don't know what the next historical total war is gonna be, to be honest. But if I had to say, it would probably be to Medieval 3, right? Because, you know, it's the furthest, the one that hasn't been out yet, you know. We got Shogun 2, we got, uh, we got Rome 2. And basically, the first game was Shogun, then Medieval 1, then Rome, then Medieval 2, then we got Empire and Napoleon, then we got Shogun 2, Rome 2. Uh, it's about time we get Medieval 3, I'd say. And it would be pretty good to see it. Oh shit, we gained more influence somehow, some way. <laughs> Then we finished up the research. Now we'll see. We only need to research. Yeah, get the ships. Wait a minute. Is there anything that's gonna. Is there anything that's not gonna increase my upkeep? Doesn't seem like it. Guess let's get this, these first. We got that. We're gonna see once I finish this civil war another is gonna appear definitely. Okay, we got that. What else can we get here? Let's see, is there anything that's gonna decrease banditry? Yeah, supply pit. That's gonna help us out a bit. Let me just check everything again here. Right, the Bretons. Oh, never mind. They're, they're dead. <laughs> At your command. As you command. Is there nothing? At your side. That is impossible. Looks like that's it for Epirus, to be honest. Doesn't seem like they expanded further up. You have the ear of my peep. Come, come, let me hear your talk. I warn you, I have no stomach for the meek or nice. You should take more money from them, to be honest. I give you greeting and my attention for the next few minutes. 
Make your case, but without a lawyer's tedium. This is not a sweet wine. Okay, we got some extra cash. Right, I need to check my guys. Anyone grab a wife? Weef. Not shit. Right, let's see. I might have enough. Probably. Nah, probably not. If we need 36,000 to recruit another general. Jesus Christ, man. I guess let's save up uh, some money so, because I do want more governors. Because the other guys are going to start dying off pretty soon. If I had to, I guess. Some of them are pretty old at this point. And I was thinking of doing Medieval too, but uh, as the Lithuanians... They're the only pagans left in Europe. So that would be a bit... Uh, no, wait a minute. That's the Teutonic campaign, I think. Twi yeah, the Great Lithuanian Commonwealth. That would be a bit of a challenge. Just a wee bit. I don't like the fact that the Empress fleets are moving towards me, to be honest. And the secessionists didn't attack either. much these are what spear infantry spear infantry any sword infantry here doesn't seem like it Let's deal with this. How serving? I do in your will is done. We hunger for battle. Jude. Let them Come on. Oh god, I mean, do I really have to fight this one as well? Fifty seven what? This is getting annoying. Like I'm playing uh, Total War Rome 1 or Medieval 2. Where you have to manually fight each battle. Might have another civil war. As I finish this one, which is gonna be a bit annoying. Oh, we'll 
artillery. Yours to command. Burn them! Your orders? Grouped and ready. Heavy cavalry ready and willing. We will go home with honor. Until then, prepare for battle. Cheer! Someday we will go home. <laughs> yes, indeed. Would be pretty interesting if this had like a mechanic like in uh, Sin Mai's Pirates, where after a while your troops or men would just, you know, be annoyed and want to go home. So you have to divide the plunder and just go start from the beginning, I guess. And want to play that game again. Hit them, that's for sure. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Field artillery awaiting orders. On the go! The fuck are they doing? Oh, that's a nice hit. We always shoot at them. We just ignore everything else. One of our units has used all its ammunition. I mean, if they're not gonna attack, I will. Let's not do that. Jesus Christ. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Thanks, unit. Charge the phalanx unit with the cam, that's for sure. Romans ready for duty. General! Your orders? Victors! Equities! Legionary cavalry! Evocati! At the double! Pack them down! Ready! Forward! Orders! Right Jupiter! 
Come on, just break. how easy we've been these battles against separatists but it takes so long to actually get to them it's a bit annoying right and they did take out two three whole provinces in the desert Pyramids here. That, that's nice at least. Look at that. And there we go. There's the money. Actually, oh, wait. Yeah, keep the keep those supply pits. Ready for we cannot follow this order. Ready for battle. To victory! Kinda. Yeah, we can do this. Much better to take this guy out separately. They're in a fort. Whatever shall I do? Although they will just... Uh, yeah, they're just gonna run out of the fort, I think. range. Okay, they can't hit them from there. We should get a million kills here. Actually, we are going to have to spread these guys out even more.
one of our units. I mean, I know what they're targeting. There's only one thing they can target. Yeah, that's definitely a good idea. I thought we were gonna get more kills with him, to be honest. No, apparently. Just try to get the, the general now. like tell them to attack here because they're all the way up there the troops are those okay, that was easy nice shot he is pretty easy yeah I don't know why this mod makes uh, the Actually, I, did, I haven't played Drone 2 in a while. Vanilla, that is. But I'm fairly sure the enemy don't try and run out of this fort when you attack him. Hmm, can't remember. They might... Wait, even when I didn't have catapults and ballistas, they still didn't run out of it.
Okay, let's see here. I think they're gonna charge out at us, even on this one. Okay, these are the ultra heavy infantry. Super heavy infantry. Reinforcements to flank enemies, I think. There's gonna be a shitload of them here. Our reinforcements have arrived! They want to charge us here. And it doesn't seem like we're going to get flanked. Plate, I mean. I should bring these guys over this way. One of our units has used all its ammunition. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Catapults will do a lot more damage than they are, especially when they're dead bunched up. So we'll try something like funnel them a little bit. I'm gonna use these to flank. Still didn't get off their ships though. I don't want to see where they're gonna go. Ammunition. 
Now they do have some phalanx units in there. That's the only thing that worries me here. I want to mash up against them that much. Ammunition. Sons of Mars. Get them all, all them flanks in. All their generals are gonna just commit suicide by sword. Those guys just ignore me. Not surprising. Cap with these. Let's not cap, let's kill them all. Fuck them. They're separatists. After all. Oh no, shit. One of our units has used all its ammunition. How many friendly fire kills did they get? Now it's running into my favor. One of our units has used all its ammunition. With all those skirmishers. <laughs> oh god. That's gonna be sweet.
400 kills, 300, 470 on the catapults. Nice. Oh, look at that. They have a sneaky fleet. We hunger for battle. Ready for battle. Advance. All of that is fine. And that's it for the separatists. I should have called this the, the separatist Delenda Est. To be honest. YouTube with all their what the hell is that? A buffalo. No such thing as a buffalo here, man. percent risk of civil war god fucking damn it you piece of shit bison Can't even improve relations with them. Oh, that's gonna suck. Next turn, another civil war pops up. European bison. Look at that. We secured them and we still have a threat of civil war from them. What's up, man? I just read your comment and then replied. Let's see here. I can improve relations with one of them at least. Actually, close all of these down. A big fan of Rome Total War 2. Well, this is modded, so it's not really. As shitty as the base game, I'd say. Basically, I need to find a way to appease these motherfuckers so I don't get the civil war just as I finish another one. No, can't get that. Minus 12 now. No wonder Rome fell. The infighting, it's what got him. <laughs> Dealing with all the politics in the Empire. basically dead I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a campaign with the Empire on uh, all realms just because they got the guns and everything else 
the cannons. I want to see how they work against enemies. Yes. Okay, place them in there. Of course, these two are at war. Wait, we did have a rebellion somewhere else. Where was it? Or oh, we are gonna have a rebellion, never mind. Probably gonna do the Empire playthrough tomorrow. I'm not sure if I do wanna go for a um, right wizard. Or do I just want to go for the, you know, normal general? We'll see. Probably the right wizard, because we do want to mess around with the overpowered magic in that too. Of course. Minus four. Minus eight. Yeah, that's, that one's going to be a problem. Killer and Gunner. I mean, a uh, warrior priest, I guess. With warrior priest with guns. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> See if we can send a diplomat somewhere. Yes, we can. Who hates me the least? Only enough, Pepper hates me the least. Egyptians, never mind. Gunner Priest. Oh, right. Uh, uh, what's the line from Warhammer 40k? Praise the Omnissiah. The Machine God. The Machine Spirit. Right, this is gonna help us. Let's see what happens next turn. If I have another separatist, then I need to like go back and recover all the shit I lost again. Oh god. I was gonna suck ass. Yeah, boss. Good night. I'm gonna need luck to not get this another rebellion instantly. Or a civil war, that is. Famous Bard, okay, that's good. Okay, good. Okay, not good. Can we get there in one turn? Yes, we can. Good. Oh, 
of course. Well, Sauron, careful with bureaucrat. Get those two. Five thrones, yeah, let's grab that. I mean, so if I fix up the cultures and all of these, I mean, most of these were dominant. I don't see why that would be a problem. Okay, now you're Egypt, uh, Egypt's problem. This one here, I think. I think he should be the youngest out of all of them. At once. You will march till your feet bleed. Good. Your and now I need to transport all of these somewhere else. Might be easier to disband them, to be honest. Just recruit them elsewhere. Because like getting him through here without losing troops to desert is gonna be a uh, hell of annoying. And we need to bring the fleets here to transport them as well. Transporting them out of here, I think. Right, I didn't want to look at Sparta. Seems like they only have three provinces. That's what I think. Uh, I want to, like, blitz them. And knock them out. Welcome. The day is all... Greetings in the name of her... Well, at least that's the idea. Mm, where could we use the governor? As we have, where do we have the least public order? Guess we can grab one here. We hunger to your duties, men. Let's see here. Tax rate. Probably the tax rate. Recorder. Crisis manager. Uh, Jesus Christ.
I think authority uh, helps them out in the public order. A little bit. Okay, can't get to him this turn. Put your backs into it, you men! Okay, oh, this should be good for now. Okay, the risk is at 0% for now. Look at how many family members are there. They're still shit compared to this guy down here, apparently. Up to minus seven. Motherfucker secessionist. Wait, who the fuck's the okay, he's the heir, family leader, emperor. He's the heir, that's good. That's why he calls zero. You cannot find a wife. Send out a bunch of diplomats. Never mind, we're out of money. That all should help us out a bit. It's only minus seven now, and hopefully, this is gonna push us over. Let's see. Might be Ashley. No. Hmm. Popping troops over to Britannia to take them out, so I don't have to worry about that whole front. Yeah, I think I, I think I need to deal with the Greece first. Rather, once I take out the actual, you know, Greek Peninsula. Be easy from then on. Hmm. 
really game. None of the other parties has organized a banquet in your capital, threatening your homogeny. How do you react? A tent? a bit further away than I would have wanted it to be. It is an honor to serve Rome. Ready for orders. To your duties, men. Finally. Ready for advance. Faster, cut you off. Gonna keep the spy there, that's for sure though. Commander. Get to it, man. I need you to get over there. I guess let's bring the fleet there just in case. Should just to convert one of these into a stadium. Better idea. Increase empire maintenance. Yes. This is gonna be annoying. Each turn I need to fuck with us.
Come on, surely that should have pushed me over to this way. This one. Second one at least. By now. Take a look at these. Push them around. Oh, there is a problem. Yeah, I keep like that for now. This is gonna take uh, quite a few turns to actually get the armies over there. And uh, I think I'm gonna just hop them over to Apollonia. Look at them. Look at his sneaky little bastards. It's gonna be annoying if they just raid and I can't attack them on the sea. I can't catch them on sea. I don't know, mind. I have a fleet right there. That's pretty good. We got some more influence for them, and they're finally good with us. Right, let me recruit uh, another guy somewhere. I think I'm gonna recruit a general here. Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes. I was gonna recruit a general there. Never mind, we can't recruit any more armies. Yep. Gonna recruit more fleets, though.
Okay, that should fix up the public order there. That's gonna fix up the public order here. I should fix it up there. I don't have enough food here. This is at zero. not mess with anything here actually we do need a bit more public order something somewhere where was it i think here no uh fuck yeah i think it's this one yeah i think it's that have to run away that far that's annoying as all hell ah shit can't get them in there so they're gonna starve It's actually gonna suck if he gets killed in a battle. Because it's a fleet. I can't really clutch those ones. But we do have uh, another. Edict place down somewhere. Guess we can use it here. Actually, let's go for more money. Probably gonna need to recruit another fleet. Can't deal with Tepris with what was it? I have two fleets down there, one in the British channel channel. Yeah, that doesn't seem like they're gonna attack me for sure. No way. I still think the Spartans are gonna be a bigger problem than Epirus. They're a bit concentrated. Depress actually spread out a bit too much, I'd say. Compared to war with the other Bavarian factions, a player in the north.
No fucking. Wait, where the hell are they? Force. I do need to kill them so they don't pick off my army with the flea toy here. We hunger that was suck ass. Boarding. It would be nice if those attacked as well. Right, right. Never mind, we can't. Mm. Yeah, let's, let's recruit a fleet. Why not? At Carthage. Julia, Julia. Wait a minute. Which one am I? Julia, Junior, Cornelia. Let's see. Damn, they cost a lot. God damn. Look at that. All my money gone. Sartre is fishing this round here. Now look at that. A moment ago, or a couple of turns ago, we had serious issues with them. Now everything's perfect. Right, you do want to get these, the favorable traits. Yeah. First for power, yeah, that's going to go well for us. I want to stabilize the situation here a little bit. Then we're going to end the stream. actually did something useful. They took out the pirates. Good job. For once. the problem here.
Two. Yeah, it seems like it. You're gonna attack for fuck's sakes anytime soon. Ready for orders. Okay, now we need to bring these over. Making Take a million turns. Ready for orders. Hard on the oars, you men. Is there nothing else? How about you find yourself a wife? Who we can promote immediately. Nice. see now you do want to get the public order up definitely because uh, it's gonna help out a lot with income and everything else see one that's actually high now look at that growth pattern and tax rate Rome isn't doing too well. Let's fix that up. Guys, to attack so I can finish that up. Okay, on, these guys are and transport these right. And look at that. I forgot how the, how good the bonuses are here. To be honest. Should bring one of those spies down into Sparta. Or that general area. Hmm. Looks like these Kim bros are making their moves against me. 
somewhere. Disease. Oh fuck. Well, I gotta get them across somehow. These guys are gonna raid there forever, apparently. Uh, I'm gonna have to move him to kill him. What exactly did we... Who died? That's your command. Oh, the women died. Wives of some of our leaders. Wait a minute. Will be able to lower this? Or shouldn't ha it have been lowered by now? more politicians I think we get that in order
Not much I can do here. Let's see. Is this gonna? Sp okay, this is gonna fix it up. So you might be able to lower down. Yes, nice. Start recruiting for this guy. Okay, let's end the turn and end the stream. That should be it. The rebels. After I clean up the south, I should be well off. I could even shift a couple of armies up here to deal with the Britons. Don't actually take that much to actually knock them out. I think I see a lot of more random races everywhere. Oh, there we go. they're gonna go up there or Egypt is gonna deal with them and really they're worth forces at the moment let's get us in for a turn then we're gonna move them oh god One, two, three, four turns till they get over there. Hey, why did I go for that? The grain, public order, same livestock, food. All right, more money. Sure, the building time is going to help us so out so much. We'll see. I need to fix up the promises because 
while I was taking out goal. I didn't really look too much or plan these out too much. Yeah, this, I haven't built anything here either. I said that was gonna end it there. Oh, never mind. Come on, Egyptians. Go take out the pirates, please. Seems like the Kimbros want to attack. And then the British have rebellions. Or Bretons. Bros. Yep. Ready oh, that's not good. Orders. Put your backs into it, you men. Yeah, let's research this. I think we're gonna need a better fleets. Okay, but I am going to end it here. So, guys, thank you for watching. And good morning, good day, good night. See you next time.